would you like the Lord to do for you today? Assess my situation. <laughs> a lot has changed. I live in a new house. I want my house to be blessed. I just want peace here forever because <laughs> it feels good so far. Amen. That's wonderful. You believe Jesus will do that for you, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I feel like he has been like the good shepherd leading you down this path, bringing you to a place of peace. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> and at the same time, everything that we go through becomes part of our ministry. So nothing's wasted. That's what I've been saying. That's incredible. Yeah. So, you know, we wonder why. Just we do things that we sure. do, but God knows nothing's wasted. God yeah. doesn't waste time. No, and I waste time by getting wrapped up in guilt and shame. So that's what I'm working on is not doing that and just allowing him to work through me. Yeah. There's a reason for it. Because he doesn't like guilt and shame. He took it and he wants to deliver you from it now. Father, we release the fire of God, you, you yourself, your holy fire. You alone are God, her healer, into Elena right now in Jesus' name. Wow, thank you, Lord. Beautiful fire of God is all around you, Elena. What do you sense the Lord is doing? Oh, it's beautiful. Praise <laughs> God. Praise God. Thank you, Father. The fire of God is all around you. I see a bloodline going into your heart. Father, we don't know. I don't know if this is a good bloodline, but I'm thinking it might be a soul tie. So, Father, we ask you to remove the soul ties in Jesus' name. That thing just right. <laughs> I literally, I, ooh, I'm sweating. <laughs> yeah, praise God for your fire, Lord. He's doing some healing in you because although you're beautiful and joyful and cheerful, you've suffered. The Lord is removing the pain from you right now in Jesus' name. All of it out in Jesus' name. All your condemnation come out in Jesus name. All shame out. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Let it out, Elena. It's okay. The Lord is healing your soul. You try, you try, you try, you try, you try. And the enemy's like got this grip on you to pull you back, 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 back. But the Lord is cutting that today in Jesus name. There is literally a chain being removed from you right now in the spirit realm. This chain has kept you in the same kind of situation for a long time. Yep, only God, only God. Thank you, Father, for the freedom that you paid for, for Elena. Wow, these are big wounds coming out of your soul, Elena. Thank you, Jesus. He's replacing these wounds with his love, fresh love from heaven. Now, the demon that's been doing this is coming out of your back right now in Jesus' name, loose her in my ribs yeah it's been wrapped around you i see it out snake get out in jesus name we've had enough of you and your mouth you're a creep we have authority over the creeps in jesus name <laughs> all tentacles out loose your grip in jesus name fire consuming fire on this thing in jesus name off her mind off her waist her ribs Oh, looser, looser, no more constricting in Jesus' name. Thank you, God. It's out. Thank you, Jesus. All hooks of religion out in Jesus' name. All religion out. I don't care if you're new age or old age, you're out in Jesus' name. Oh, praise God. Fresh light of God into our temple. Fresh light. Overtake everything, Father, in Jesus' name. Fresh light, ooh, fresh water is being released into you like a dry and weary land. Thank you, Lord. Fresh waters are being released into you, Elena. Oh, he's wonderful. Well, you must feel lighter. Thank you, Lord. What'd you just feel happen? It's like a, it's just like a thing that doesn't want to go, but it's like, it's like out, but it's like holding on. Mm. You're right. So Father, whatever has, whatever legal right this thing has, we break it off of her right now in Jesus' name. Any unforgiveness? Uh, try, 
not consciously. Yeah. So Father, remove it from the memory banks in Jesus name. Here we go. You're going to get <laughs> unlocked right now. Off the DNA, off the DNA, off, up and out in Jesus name. This is exactly what Jesus meant when he said, I cast you out. Off the DNA and out in Jesus, in Jesus name. Every grip be released. In Jesus' mighty name, oh. you will not come back into her. There you go. Praise God. Yeah, it's my dad. <sighs> now, there's a dark cloud over you. Father, we want it out. In Jesus' name, we bind the enemy's cloud over her. All spiritual guides off in Jesus' name. All the familiar out. Thank you, Lord. Because God has good plans for you right now. This is a good time in your life. Thank you, Jesus. Fire. <laughs> yeah, sure. Thank you, Lord. Fire of health, healing, and happiness into Elena. Oh, thank you, Jesus. You are smoking. You are smoking right now. All I see is the fire all around you. Praise God. Oh, I'm so happy for you. It is about time huh i love him so much like you i can't you know i can't say you i know. remember I, when I, I first met you what what was it that you did in the occult you were some kind of a, a what what was it that I you did a womb priestess <laughs> yeah. i don't know oh yeah i forget <laughs> what it was but anyway look at you now yeah car yeah it was crazy Praise God. Oh, I love him so much. Praise God. Yeah. You know, I see a real freedom in you. I've, I've never seen yeah. you this free. Oh, yeah. This has been a great year. I just, this and is I love him so much. This is a year for Elena. <laughs> yep. Because so, I have no fear. I have no fear. And so I was able to just receive, you know, <sighs> been great <laughs> this is wonderful so yeah. you know your prayers have all been answered not only are you delivered and healed but you've reconnected with your children in a seriously healthy yeah. loving way praise them <laughs> hmm. you've been making seriously good choices yeah yeah so uh i'm seeing that the lord has a job for you okay What's he, what it, what's he been saying to you to not worry about my old the people from my old life and that there's people waiting for me who i don't know yet amen and you know what i think the old life was the bloodline that was just dried up yeah because as long really as you're kept in bondage with the old the new can't find a way in Right. So I'm, it's a fear of, well, okay, here's my fear, I guess, but it's not so much. It's a habit. It's not a spirit of fear. Right. Right. It's more of a habit of that in between time where you're transitioning in that alone time with, which I know I'm meant to spend with him. So it's fine. Exactly. And why do you think you're going to spend it with him? Because he's going to teach you the difference between God love and world love. Yeah. Because they are totally different. Yeah. They're totally different. And it's not our job to be the Messiah and go fix people either. No. That's a just one, -on -one them, personal just relationship. I'm just like, every person I meet, I somehow find a way to talk about Jesus. And what's so fascinating is that all of them will say, well, I grew up in the church, but I don't know how I feel about it. But I kind of like what you're saying about Jesus because it doesn't sound religious and it's just perfect every time. You know, because that's <laughs> so, him. That's him inside of you. And I believe that's your mission in life. Yeah. <laughs> it's like you're yeah. going to be uh, a street evangelist. Right. I almost feel like I'm tricking people, but I'm not. <laughs> I'm just like you're not. And you see, the thing is, is... Most people don't want to listen to people who talk about Jesus. But when Jesus is in control, like he is in your life right now, he knows how to enter a person's soul into that yes. very heart, just with the words that he speaks through your face. 
Yes. Yeah, he's just amazing. I feel like I hit the lottery. Like, honestly, I, I don't think I would be this happy if I hit the lottery. <laughs> there, there's no comparison. There's no wealth in this world that can compare to a relationship with Jesus. No. <laughs> so how do you feel right now? I mean, uh, I mean, it let go. Yeah, I feel free. I feel more free. I saw it let go. I saw it yeah. cleaning, but it, it had to go. Amen. Yeah, and started going to the Pentecostal church. Praise God. So, so now you're in that really church? changed everything. Everything is changed. I was. Yeah, but they, they closed down for COVID last week. So I was going there though. And I got baptized by the pastor there. Um, I know Wonder that we did that, but then I got an actual. Yeah, it was great. <laughs> and it was on I went in there to ask them. Up. We did. And then I went in there to ask about getting baptized, you know, by the pastor there. Cause I, I don't know. I just wanted to do it again. I'm so glad you did. And I, and I did it. I went to ask them about it and they said, well, you know, what's funny about that is that today is the day of Pentecost. <laughs> I was like, what? Like, what are the chances? What, what the are the chances you get baptized on Pentecost? Hallelujah, <laughs> Elena. God has big plans for you, girl. So what do you yeah. want to say to Jesus? Oh gosh, I just love him so much. <laughs> I just love him so much. Like, I'm just, I'm just so grateful that he chose me. Because I are didn't we blessed? It. We are so blessed to belong to him. Yeah. What would you say to somebody who has come from the occult, messed up childhood life to where Jesus has brought you right now? There's just no freedom anywhere but here. None. Not, e not even a little bit. Because as soon as you think you find it, Satan just mocks you instantly. And it's gone. This is the only place where, it's, where you're free forever. Now, you've worked for him. What kind of a taskmaster is he? Oh, he just wants to make a, a mockery of you. He doesn't even care if you do anything to anyone else. He's only here to destroy your soul and that's it. That's it. But he thinks just your he soul, makes just people believe it. that they're gaining ground, but they're not. Because the only one he, that he ever cares no, about is himself. He, he want, yeah, he just want, he'll take you so far and make you think you're getting somewhere just to see you fall harder. Yeah, because you know, one thing is I, for sure. I talk to Anybody who believes the devil's promises that is in the occult right now, he will never keep those promises. And the proof is this, you were made in the image of the one he despises. There is no way he will keep his promises to a human being. Amen. No. Amen. Now, what's it like serving Jesus? Ah. <laughs> It's just one surprise. If you want to talk about supernatural. <laughs> there you one. go. <laughs> you have met the king of supernatural. Amen. You're way more fun. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Well, we thank you for your testimony, Elaine, and I'm so proud of you. You've done so good. Rough roads. You didn't take your eyes off of Jesus. You stood in faith and he stood with you. Amen. Amen. At JesusTodayMinistries.org, we are here to minister and to pray with you right in the comfort of your own home or your office. If you are seeking counseling, healing, deliverance, financial breakthrough, if you feel that there is a block or you're experiencing hindrance in your blessings, please know that God cares about you and all that concerns you. Hi, my name is Peggy Golden. I am a pastor and I have a master's in Christian counseling. God has made a way for people all over the world to receive counsel, healing, and deliverance through the use of technology right in your own homes. God heals, saves, and delivers his people every hour of the day. There is no distance for God. If you do not know God, if you are seeking him, or if you have found yourself in a situation that you need help getting out of, please know nothing is too hard for God. Please visit my website 
at jesustodayministries.org. You can get to know more about me there. And please remember to read the testimonials of what others have experienced by contacting this ministry. There is no fee, but you are able to make a donation. For those who are in the States as well as international clients, we can use voice or video chat on Skype, WhatsApp, Facebook Messenger, or Viber. I look forward to praying with you and all that God will do.